going to uh, show you a home movie. That's me. And that's my grandfather. He's the first person to ever teach me magic. I was about 10 years old, and he taught me a card trick with four aces. And the aces would appear and disappear. It was really cool. And since I was 10 years old, it took me many months to master it. After I did, I showed it to everybody, and I decided to make magic my life. Everybody thought I was crazy, except my grandfather, who always gave me encouragement. And I promised him if I ever had any success that I would do his card trick in my show. Well, my grandfather passed away before I ever did a big show. But Grandpa, if you're listening, tonight I'm going to keep my promise. Barclay House mysteriously burned to the ground. All of its inhabitants perished in the fire, or did they? David Copperfield confronts the spirits of Barclay House. And stand by to touch your television and make the magic happen right at your fingertips. The Magic of David Copperfield. Sponsored by Saturn. A different kind of company. A different kind of car. Last summer, we invited everyone who owns a Saturn to visit Spring Hill, a Saturn homecoming. They could see where their cars were built and meet the people who built them. We could thank them for believing in us. 44,000 people spent their vacations with us at a car plant. Of course, not everything went exactly as planned. But we were all in it together, the way we always have been. Skipper's gonna make a change. 
Remember, fans, today's game is being brought to you by new improved Kingsford. Ready twice as fast as other charcoal and burns even longer. New Kingsford, the sure fire. Hey, this guy has some serious heat. How about that? Introducing Sierra Femme Fatale from Redline. Because the female of the species is more dangerous than the male. The dangerously female fragrance, Sierra Femme Fatale by Redline. Have you heard? This summer, little boys will become fish. Fences will turn into tight ropes. And country time will turn pink. Wonders never cease. You're the principal topic of my conversation. You're the principal source of my inspiration. The principal star of my sky. For the principal people in your life, the principal financial group. Insurance, pensions, managed health care, and more. You're the principal reason I do what I do. The principal reason is you. The principal. For over a century, your edge on the future. Right now, we're going to show you something you won't believe. It's your turn to get into the act. The only thing I ask you is to come up to the television, close enough to touch the screen. It's important that you can touch the screen because you're going to feel and experience something totally amazing. In a moment, you're going to place your finger here on the 12 and move around the face of the clock at random from number to number. Completely free choice. Even though you're at home and I'm here, I'll know exactly where your finger is. I want you to clear your thoughts and think of any number from 1 to 12. It's your choice. Now, I have no idea what number you're thinking of. In a moment, you're going to spell your secret number. Letter by letter, moving your finger clockwise around the numbers. For example, if your secret number was six, you'd begin with your finger on the 12 and spell clockwise around the numbers, moving one position for each letter. S, I, X, keeping your finger there. This will bring you to a new number. If your secret number was 12, you'd spell T, W, E, L, V, E. Now place your finger on the 12 and spell your secret number. Do it now. Great. Look at the number that's underneath your finger now. Spell the number that's now under your finger, using one position for each letter of the number, stopping on the last letter. If you need to, just keep going around the clock. Your finger is now on a new number. Spell the new number under your finger. One position for each letter now. Remembering to stop the last letter and keep your finger there. Now, I know you're not on the number two, so I'll take it away. And I can tell you're not on the number four or the eight. And I'm sure you're not on the 12. Okay, one last time. Spell the final number under your finger. One position for each letter, skipping the empty spaces. And stop for the final time. I know you're not in the number three, and you're not in the ten, and I know that you're not in the five. I want to remind you I had no idea what number you thought of, or how many letters each number had, or the amount of moves you made, so there's no possible way I could know what number your finger is on. But even though you're at home and I'm here, I'm going to find where your finger is touching. Keep your finger still, and watch. on the sixth. Next, David Copperfield challenges the restless spirits that inhabit this room. Without camera tricks or video effects, we confront the dark forces of Barclay House. <laughs>